Hey fellow Terrarians, let's do this guide using a hardcore character. Let's spice things up a little. Alright, so Empress of Light, Daytime, uh, the Legendary Seed, the Zenith or Everything Seed, and a Legendary Mode, so, you know, biggest uh, HP that you can get for, for this particular boss. Okay, so, <laughs> big arena, okay, so essentially arena is... Uh, just uh, you know, build an asphalt road. Okay, so the reason we're fighting, the, you know, the reason for this guide is actually uh, recent changes to the game, rendering you know those uh, immunity buffs essentially useless, right? So she can still one-shot you during daytime. So we will be using uh, proper tactics now this time. So we're gonna follow a particular pattern. Okay, so here we are, the arena and a long asphalt road. Okay, so I'm actually walled up the entire place here to you know, re remove the mob spawns from from you know from the equation so this is gonna make things easier okay so we're gonna use a ranger setup nothing special all of these items are obtainable pre golem okay and you notice that um, using the mini nuke one with this unreal snowman cannon to maximize the damage rocket uh, setup for shroomite uh, armor right so and then you see i'm using wings well i'm using empress wings because i fought her during night which is much easier and i got the wings and i got the insignia both of these items well insignia is very good Sorry, insignia. Uh, the wings you can use whatever, right? But the rest is pretty much straightforward, right? Maximizing damage and mobility. And uh, ninja gear is just for the dash, not really for for the chance to get, uh, you know, to avoid her hits because she can hit through, right? So she can one shot you. There's no no protection buff that can save you this time. Okay, so let's go straight into it. So the pattern we need to just follow a particular pattern here. Okay, so uh, there are many different patterns you can play play this, but I'm I'm giving you the easiest. Okay, so first two attacks. Well, this is the first attack, and the second attack is the dash. You just run away, and you see the petal attack, the flower, the sun dance, or whatever. You just again stay away from from the projectiles, right? So first attack, second attack, then it's going to be a dash, and you just go up diagonally and in a semicircle. Okay, so avoiding her attack session, you can just pause this video to make sure you are uh, um, learning the pattern, right? So, but the, the, the first phase is nothing special. All you have to do is keep your distance. Okay, one, two, the, those two attacks are missing, and then the dash, you just go up, and then semicircle, go down, boom, and then again, one, two two attacks we're gonna miss then the dash and then the sunflower right and you gain you just stay away from those petals even, even the edges can 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 sometimes hit you okay and now we're almost at half half hp it's going to be phase two and that's going to be pretty dangerous you'll see the first attack is going to be essentially very very bad so so in here you go up up and to the right semicircle and to the right and you avoid all those uh, dancing glancing blows okay then up diagonally semicircle then straight down see i'm using the queen slime mount to give me some extra mobility and time it's very forgiving flexible then semicircle down and then to the right and then now up up to the right semicircle to the right avoiding those attacks and then to the left avoiding the dash going up diagonally semicircle down and to the left run away run away from the flower and then go up and she's almost done by the way guys so again semicircle down oh that's close okay so then again to the right and up up to the right to the right to the right and down and then left and then avoid the dash going up diagonally again see that it's always repeating there's nothing really special there's even a little bit of flexibility I would say it's it's not as punishing as more advanced uh, patterns and it's easy to memorize again pause this video if you are struggling but again up up to the right and she's done see that was maximum possible HP that you get uh, her at right because she's here the beefiest of all seeds right so we got our Terra Prisma we got the relic 
we got on oh, can't put put it here because this is actuated so let's go up anyway guys so again this is just to show you a, a, a way to defeat her in a fair fight using pre golem gear using a hardcore character using okay so this bow can't be used anyway unreal snowman cannon okay so um that's the i mean you can use a gun you can use whatever but it's in a mage setup but essentially this is a very straightforward setup thank you for watching hope you succeed in your quest to defeat her during daytime and yeah i'll see you in the next video thank you and goodbye